The Powell Panthers were playing their first home game of the year after their quarterback, Ethan Asher, was seriously injured in an automobile accident. Schools from around the state have raised funds for the Asher family, and that has to be commended. The Panthers, who won their season opener last week against Riverton, took on the Warland Warriors. After a scoreless first quarter, Powell got on the board thanks to a touchdown completion from Landon Langfelder to Braley Gann that covered 23 yards, so the Panthers drew first blood, leading 7-0. After a scoreless third quarter, things got interesting. Adrian Geller had a pick six for Paul, so the Panthers assumed a two-touchdown lead, and that was followed by a Panther field goal to bump the lead to 17. Worland found the end zone in the final stanza as Rudy Sanford tossed a 13-yard TD pass to Devin Mercado to cut the gap to 17-7. Paul answered that TD with one of the road as Caden Abraham scampered into the end zone from 23 yards out. The final in this contest, Paul 24 and Worland 7. Powell will travel to Lander this week while Worland will host Cody.